Hey guys, this looks like a fun one. It says solve for X. We're given log base four of the quantity log base three of X whole thing cubed equals 4.5. This is day 23 of our algebra March calendar. If you want to try it on your own, pause it right now because I'm going to solve it in three, two, one. First, let's go over all the notes we're going to need. The first one says if you have log base B of A equals X, that's the same thing as b to the x equals a. One way you can think of it is this to the power of this equals this. And that's what's going on right here. It's the base of the log to the power of this equals this. And the other piece of logarithm notes we'll need is this right here. Anytime this input has an exponent, you can bring that exponent to the front. So this log base b of a to the c is the same thing as c times log base b of a. So this can be brought to the front or it can be brought out here. And last, we have these notes for rational exponents. Anytime you have one of these rational exponents, the denominator is the root and the numerator is the exponent. And now that you have these notes, if you want to try it on your own, pause it right now because I'm going to solve it in three, two, one. First, let's copy it down and let's bring this exponent to the front. Now we have three times all of this equals 4.5. We can get rid of this three by dividing both sides by three. And now on the left-hand side, the three on top and on bottom will cancel each other out. And on the right-hand side, this 4.5 over three, we can simplify this fraction by dividing top and bottom by 1.5. 4.5 divided by 1.5 is three, and three divided by 1.5 is two. So we have all of this is equal to three over two. So now we're gonna use these notes for logarithms. It's this to the power of this equals this. So it's gonna be this to the power of this equals this. So we end up with four to the power of three halves equals log base three of x. On the left-hand side, we have a rational exponent. Let's play around with that for a second. Here are the notes for that. First, we know there's gonna be a radical, and then this base of four is gonna be inside the radical. And the two in the denominator tells us it's a square root, and this three is gonna be the exponent. And then typically with square roots, we don't include the two. So we have four to the power of three over two is the same thing as the square root of four to the power of three. Let's replace it over here. So this is equal to this. And now square root of four is equal to two, and then two cubed is equal to eight. And now we're ready to do these notes again. This to the power of this equals this. So this to the power of this will equal this. We have three to the eighth power is equal to x. And three to the eighth power is 65, 61. This is the answer to our question. In this equation, x is equal to 65, 61. Let's put a box around it. How exciting. And here's tomorrow's problem. We're given the square root of x plus the square root of the quantity x plus 42 equals seven over the square root of x. This looks like a fun one. How exciting.